You're watching ABC4 News. Welcome back, everyone. It's a race against time to get someone help if they are suffering a stroke. With a look at the signs, symptoms, and what you can do to make a difference, Saray Chin joins us with an important conversation with Intermountain Healthcare. Every second counts when you are suffering a stroke. We have Dr. Megan Donahue, the medical director of the Comprehensive Stroke Center at Intermountain Medical Center at Intermountain Healthcare. Hello, Dr. Donahue. Hi. When we are talking about a stroke, 32,000 neurons die each second someone is suffering from a stroke. Time matters. Yes, that is a very important message because the sooner you can get treatment, the, the sooner you can get to a hospital, the, the more treatments you have available. Tell us about the signs and the symptoms. We have an acronym that Intermountain Healthcare has been great at saying time and time again, it's be fast. What does that mean? Sure. Um, basically, any signs or symptoms of stroke are going to happen suddenly, and we use be fast to help remind people about the symptoms of stroke. So B stands for balance. E stands for eyes or vision. F stands for face, like a droopy face. Um, A stands for arm, so one arm drooping. S stands for speech, and T stands for time. So call 911 as soon as possible. And you also say there are two types of strokes. What exactly is a stroke and what is happening to the body? Great question. Um, so a stroke is when a portion of the brain is not getting adequate blood flow and is starting to die. Um, the most common type of stroke is when there is lack of blood flow because an artery is blocked. The other type of stroke would be a hemorrhagic stroke and tissue is damaged because the bleeding causes pressure on that area of the brain and that for that reason it's not getting enough blood flow either. There is amazing technology and medical care when it comes to people who are uh, suffering from a stroke and, and the treatment available. In fact, the sooner you can get to the hospital, uh, the sooner maybe you can reverse some of the symptoms and the brain damage. Definitely. We have a lot of treatments available now, whether it's through the IV, IV medication called Altaplase or TPA, or whether we go in and try to remove a clot if it's big enough. But all of those treatments require you to come in as soon as you notice the symptoms and have to be administered within four and a half hours or within 24 hours of symptom onset. So the sooner you come, the more possible treatments are available. What's also amazing is Intermountain Healthcare has the ability to administer these types of treatments right on the spot. Yes, exactly. And we get people in very quickly and get them all the tests needed to administer that medication uh, within 30 minutes of arrival the majority of the time. Dr. Donahue, thank you so much with Intermountain Healthcare for more information on stroke, this being um, Stroke Awareness Month, um, a lot of resources on the website as well, intermountainhealthcare.org. Again, thank you so much for your time. Oh, thanks for having me.